Guys, we are officially in New York City. <laughs> I'm here for a weekend having a good time me and my man candy. I'm so tired You have no idea. I literally was lugging around a fucking huge ass bag that weighs more than me I am staying in the Arlo Nomad Hotel. This is north of Madison. The Empire State Building's right there I'm right here Boom, so this is the door that I walk in. There's this door thing here. I don't know what's in there. Our stuff is on the floor. The bed is right there. We have a cute little office. The TV in the most awkward spot because the bed's over here. Have my bag over there. And then we have this whole window. It's pretty much the whole entire wall here, but I have literally the Empire State Building right over here. But bro, look. Oh, those are my shoes. I'm trying to show you outside, but you really can't see it. This is the view from down there. Guys, this is insane. I opened the window and look at the view. The windows only crack a little bit. So that's this window. I can't wait to see this at night. It's gonna be gorge, literally laying here. This is my view of New York. It's so fucking pretty. I really, really enjoy floor to ceiling windows. I love New York. I eventually wanna move out here. I can't wait to see this at night when it's literally like lit and looking gorge. Small little area over here. Don't know what this is for, probably for random stuff. There's a safe, a little mini fridge. Okay, so then this is the bathroom. You can close the door, obviously. They have some towels there. Toilet, toilet paper. What's this? This says spare. Oh, it's toilet paper in here. I'm not reading that. Cute little sink, some water's there. And then we have a shower. There's the shampoo, conditioner, body wash. We're waiting for the elevator. stupid because out of all of the places that we can be going to we're picking a chain and not like another place but it is what it is because yeah. shake shack is so good don't you love shake shack Rick? Mm -hmm. so good. shake shack is so good look at all the kids and stuff everybody's playing everyone basically just does whatever the fuck they want here follow your own fucking dreams do what you gotta do go all right so right now we're literally just sitting on a cute little bench at the park and we're deciding what we want to do for food because the Shake Shack we were going to go to isn't even actually open. It's fucking closed. I will keep you guys posted and I will let you know exactly where we go. But as of now, I'm just chilling. <laughs> such a good youtuber he told me to tell you guys where we got the pizza because i forgot we got it at little italy pizza in little italy new york manhattan so good off madison ave pretty fucking good they were a little rough in there i feel like new yorkers are just a little bit rough they take things a little bit seriously like i was standing there looking at the pizza for one second and the guy's like what do you want like sir can i figure it out so carry yourself with confidence so they don't fuck with you but it's really good i recommend the margarita pizza Bye. this is such a pretty place it's so busy and hectic at all times <laughs> Avenue. How are you liking New York, boo? 
All right, so we are back in our hotel. I got my jacket. I'm wearing a vintage leather jacket. It's literally vintage because this was- Who's was this? This was his great grandpa's. So girl, real vintage. I have a little Adidas bag with my wallet in there. I have a Ariana Grande crop top. I'd be wearing this shit because it's comfy. Cute baggy pants, Nikes, and a scarf because I'm just extra. So I'm like, excuse me. So right now we're gonna go to Madame Tussauds. I have been to Madame Tussauds three times. So this is gonna be my fourth. My husband has never been to Madame Tussauds though. So I wanna make sure he's enjoying his first day. It's about like 20 minutes of walking to get there. So I'm just gonna enjoy the walk. I don't know if I'm gonna film, if I see anything crazy, I'll film, but I wanna enjoy New York. Let's go to Madame Tussauds. Cute. I can't wait to see this at night. That's like what I'm dying to see, all the pretty lights. Guys, this elevator is literally on X Games mode. Look at how fast that shit goes. When you're in the elevator, bitch, I'm telling you, you're literally flying. Ryan Seacrest himself. I'm so dead. Oh my god. It doesn't even look that much like her though. Yo. I'm so <laughs> dead. I love Miley. This necklace, I'm like, oh my god, as I take the necklace, just kidding. But look, even the tattoos they got on point. Miley, I love you, baby. I love you. This is literally hey T. We all know Taylor. Right when you get in. Look over here. Lord. Can we please talk about Miss Kim? Yes, Kim. Yes, Kim. That's not that big. This is so cute. Hey guys. Hey mom. Hey mom. Gorge. Oh my god. Gorge. Go next to her. Chris looks so real. Look at the ring. The little details. The shoes. Yes, Chris Jenner. Look at that. Oh my god. Yeah. Oh my god. Mama Ru, I love you so much. Look at the eyes. Yeah! Look at the nails. So pretty. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. Oh my god. Of course. Yeah. Daddy. Oh, no big deal. Just, you know, stand for pulling. I get my Oh! You don't really know where you're going. Like this is glass. It kind of gets you lost. Oh my god, it's literally just me. Dead end, I gotta go back. Yo, you really don't even know where you're going. Fun little place. Yeah, see ya. Ah. Oh
guys. It is the one, the only Princess Diana. We're in a fake subway right now. Answer the call. Weird. They have like a bunch of areas where you can take photos. So after we left Madame Tussauds, I don't really know exactly what happened, but the audio kept getting messed up. I wish you guys can hear how loud and noisy the city was, especially during this time. But we basically left Madame Tussauds and went to Junior's Cheesecake. That's where the New York Cheesecake was invented. So we wanted to check that out. Sorry for the audio getting messed up, but you will still hear my opinions. So as you guys can tell, the cheesecake was $9.25, kind of expensive. Santino was so excited to try it, but honestly, we weren't that pleased it was pretty good but the flavor on top of that strawberry glaze thing just tasted very artificial and i really don't think it's worth the ten dollars but the cheesecake was actually still good let me not talk shit all right so then right after we ate the cheesecake we made our way to the world's largest macy's in new york city it's really nice in there the audio still wasn't working very well it kind of sucked after that we ended up going outside and looking at the macy's displays it's just something that everybody has to do if they're in new york in december highly recommend so cute adorbs and then right when we were about to get back to our hotel, we actually ran into Miss Lady Gaga herself. And we got to see the Don Perignon and Lady Gaga champagne advertisement. Gorgeous, amazing way to end the night. Back to the hotel. We just got back. I also want to show you guys what we bought at Madame Tussauds. These are cute little keychains. They were $7.95. For New York, that's kind of cheap. They look shitty on this camera, but in all reality, they really sparkle when actual light hits them. So I got a cute little rainbow to go with my keys. And Santino got a cute butterfly. Can you tell we're gay? <laughs> This is the view of the motherfucking hotel. The view of New York at night. You can't even tell at all on camera. At literally all. What I'm seeing. But this is like the best the best fucking thing I've ever done. I swear to God, seeing the buildings, enjoying the city. It's for me because bitch, it's New York.